All right, here we go. This is just the low one. This is the highest part. It's not low at all. No, 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 no. You want lower, don't you? Yeah. You want to go all the way low? Not all the way low. <laughs> this is in Sandusky. I'll have to do it. Down from Grandma's house. Okay. Send me the address. Ah! <gasps> Somebody's on your live, Dad. Well, join the club, which is how a surprise visit from Rebecca Parrish. Some might say an ambush. Director of National Intelligence. Yeah. Guess I ain't low she enough, she said. The past 20 minutes, and that's not all. She's asked to see you. Yeah, it's not low enough. My hair looks crazy right now. My Sigma shirt. Good morning. Mr. Baldwin. Oh, I got hair in my mouth. The pleasure's all ours. I know that you have difficult jobs here. You got three people now. Lately, it seems that we've had nothing but bad news coming out of Seattle. Promise News is growing. The founding of Promise City was a major defeat for this agency and in the administration. It's temporary. Dad ripping my hair out. Oh my God, I look like Dad. I like your attitude, but you think it may be a little short. Because we <laughs> I was hoping you, but bold. You've been watching the little things. <laughs> no, we have right. Richard Tyler and his like daughter it. surrounded, outnumbered. The situation was crazy? in hand, and we lost a man. Uh -huh. Do I look crazy? With all due respect, I was there, and that situation was yeah. in hand. Richard Tyler has become an I bet you when I put makeup on, all of the bus But right now, I do not look crazy. In two weeks. I'm being asked to test Dad's ripping my hair out. Something does it hurt? Yeah. Just a little bit. I'll be here for the entire week to prepare. And my forehead looks so big. <laughs> I for real look like Dad. Miss Parrish asked to meet my two best agents. That's why you're here. That's also. I need to re dye my hair. That's what I need to do. I trust this won't be a problem. That's why it looks so weird. There's five people watching, but I can't, or four, I can't see who it is, so. Agent Baldwin? G, 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 G. Did you Robert, your mom's on here! Oh! Ow! You're ripping my hair out! Tom just wants to get to work. I don't know, Beautiful. Sarah's doing it. Uh, Period. I told her not to. I've seen yourself in the future when it's not me. I'm doing things I would never do. What if they're not just dreams? What if they're someone else's memories? What if they really did put something inside me when I was in that hospital? What if, what if it's starting to crack me? Because Guess what I'm now. doing? Whoa, Tom, hey, listen. Even if you're right, it, it, it doesn't happen yet. You're still you. Okay, so we can find it. Rico, connect. Have you see a doctor since these, these dreams began? Okay, why don't you start there? Go what? Find yourself a private physician, get yourself checked out. We're supposed to be looking for Richard. Just go, go. I'll cover for you. Oh, Dad! Ripping my hair out, man. <laughs> Jesus. It happens. Y'all men go through pain while shaving your head, don't ya? Look at this. I look crazy. You got long hair. Or a long hair. Richard. GG. How long have I been gone? Starting the new year with new hair. So I can grow it out and have natural pretty hair. People can't judge me because people, some people do this to their babies. I know I'm not a baby, but like. You'll never watch it after you see this Huh? Who's watching? Oh. Yeah, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. You still don't believe I'm real, do you? I'm joining the army. I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, ten people are watching right now. Ah! 
No speed that is in watch. I have a big forehead, yo. I just realized that. My boyfriend's judging me right now, saying I have a big forehead. Somebody punch him. These clippers suck. Go get the other one then. Ow. Go get the other ones then. I look crazy with half head shaved though. So I'm gonna just do this. That's alright. No, you're gonna rip my hair off. Go get the I'll other, other one. ones. She looks uh. nice too. You can see why you see the picture. Mine looks a little bit. I don't know. There's nothing different about me, Diana. I had every test that I gave me. You all say I'm perfect health. Hey, Kayla shaved her head at like the same time. Yeah. She rocked the bed. Tom. Tom. Head. True. What's going on? Sorry for the intrusion. Okay, no. My security okay, detail is nothing if not thorough. Oh, wait, wait, they have to be. The administration is everywhere. I got hair all over me. I'll see you in the morning. Would you in private? Yeah, I'll see you in the morning. Gentlemen? Babe, am I Gentlemen, beautiful? Agent Baldwin and I need the room. Yes, Thank you. <laughs> this is my house. I'm going to pay you the respect of being frank. I was a little concerned with your outburst in the store's right office this morning. I sent you Robert's sure dad and... Oh! Your mom said she sent it to your dad and... Um, this might surprise you, but I think I have an idea of what you're doing. I'm bowed. Right after mm. I took this job, I felt... Like I was on the verge of a breakdown I look key, feel way I confident with the shaved head, not gonna lie. And I was having Even though I look like a body, I, I look like my dad, things. I know, and I have, like, <laughs> I have a rat tail right now. I have a rat tail! Robert, you remember when you had one? <laughs> um, I'm living my life, cut my hair so I can start over and not have dead hair anymore. That's pretty much what I'm doing, so... That's hard to say. Once you Shaving forward, it all off so I can have natural hair. I'm going to wear a wig or just rock it days. because, I it yeah. I, I just want to start all over oh, with my hair. I just <laughs> so, yeah. I'm Might as well do it when it you're living life. Do, do, it while you're young. do it while you're young. YOLO. For real. I'm happier. My friends tell me that I'm like a new person. Right, you need to rock it. You I will relax. rock it, but I bought a wig what too, so to? I can, Just you know, you do both. You'll feel rock it better. and hide it a little bit, just a little bit, when I don't feel comfortable. But I'm gonna have Dad shave it, and I'm gonna uh, probably dye it black. Probably dye it black. You're saying even though I'm gonna rock the natural hair once it grows out, but this. Red is not busting right now. It's not doing it. I already bought the wig. It's crazy. And I thought we'd be approving of this, but I have to go with Tom. I think that there's a very good chance that direct national intelligence is. We're going to have to be very careful with how to proceed. And Tap will be looking for what you're tired of. So we'll keep doing it. I'm passing the case over to Garrity and Ashmore. Tom, you're taking personal leave tomorrow. Diana and I will keep an eye on you and watch over you in shifts. I'm sorry, Sean. What are you asking me to tell people not to take your license? Only for a few months. Joe and I, I know that we have had our differences in the past, but this is good for good. both of us. All huh? we have to do is be patient. I think it's not okay. Yeah. It concerns me. Mm -hmm. Just the worldwide implications of this test. Sean. There were millions of people with abilities and millions without like any children. chance of having them. Yes, but they would be alive. And living in a world with two classes of human being. Sean, positives and negatives cannot live side by side. Those without abilities will tear like down the ones who have right or 
The Pastas will simply use their powers to rid themselves of the negatives. Inquisition or Holocaust, either way, it's a recipe for hell on earth. What's your alternative? Do you really want the entire world to take from my Yes, yes, I do. It's what I've always said has to happen. Half of the planet will die. You're talking about mass suicide. I'm talking about a single generation of sacrifice. And at the end of it, a more fully evolved species. John. All of our feelings as human beings will be addressed when we are all gifted. I got those big Rico ears. I am not making any announcement. And no one who cares about what's right for the world would. Oh, <gasps> Keely's on here. Yo! <laughs> Robert! Come here. Keely's on here. I don't know if she still is, but... Probably. She seems so happy. Her toddler's supposed to be ready. Oh, well, isn't there a stack of moments? Good. Believe me, I'm sure she has. <laughs> she's like, Mom, I got back. I've been thinking about what it must have been like for you, raising her on your own. I'm bowed. What'd she say? I can't see that. There's nothing that makes it any less wonderful. Oh. Still. Piss off, Keely. <laughs> I think Keith is on here. Hey, my baby. You're a great father, Richard. I can't see that far. It's kind of like tiny little writing. I'm definitely using my ability on the show. Oh, there's a lot of families on here. Yeah, Keith said, heck yeah. Just make him see her. Everything we talk about comes from you. Not fully bald, but pretty much bald. Oh, yeah. I wish longer I could do this. Come on, you're tired. Yeah, I wanted a patch of hair still. Not like completely. Yeah. Butt naked body. But why not? I got hair in my nose. <laughs> oh, no. Supporting all the baldies out there. Help me work out some of the last time you tried to do it. Too soon for that. Richard's not ready to give her up yet. This is just the first part of the plan to get her back. When we're ready for the next part, I'll be right back. Oh, you can tell me. Uh. Angelica. Did you know he was involved with your grandmother? Why do you think we picked these two? After we send them back to their time, they'll find each other. They'll form a bond. It's done. She's ready. Mom, Am I going to be next? No. No, we're not shaving. He doesn't that. want to shave it. Oh, what did Keith say? They got that shirt for fat guys. Um, I think so. <laughs> no, it's a pretty big. Robert bought the shirt. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there's so much hair on me. Yeah, you did have a lot of hair, baby. You gotta remember. God, how much I hated her. So much noise in this time period. So many people. Look at them. They have no idea what's coming. They just move from pointless errand to pointless errand. Oh, I want one. It's disgusting. <laughs> I think you'd be glad just to be alive. 
Were you given a chance to continue your work? The work that failed so badly? The work that got my previous host put? Don't blame your shortcomings on Matthew Ross. We are our hosts. Your inability to harness Isabel Tyler was your failure. I'll do better this time. You need to get back to work. <laughs> Convince them to return you to active duty. I'll pull some strings if I have to. But it's better if you got it done on your own. And after I'm there? It's the easy part. Do what Tom Baldwin would do. Find Isabel Tyler. I'll be in touch. So I can trim it like right there. Thanks for enjoying and watching that. She wanted to get it done. Daddy had to get it done. And now that goes.